are here today to talk to you about our store, Green Market. First off, when you hear the word organic, what words come to mind? Can you guys um, Freshness. Freshness. Healthy. Natural. Expensive. Disgusting. Pesticide. Was it pesticide? Pesticide? No chemicals. <laughs> <laughs> or radiation. Green. Uh, uh, those are good, but here are the official standards for the products to be USDA organically certified. The product must contain at least 95% organic ingredients and be grown with natural fertilizers and without pesticides. Uh, the, produ the producer has to naturally remove weeds instead of using chemicals, and the term made of organic ingredients means it has at least 70% organic ingredients in it. And for meats to be organically certified, the animal must be allowed free range, or in other terms, to naturally graze. And the farmers can only give the animals organic grains while withholding growth hormones or antibiotics. However, all these organic definitions change depending on which country you reside in. Alright, to uh, demonstrate the difference between organic and non-organic, would anybody like to come up for a taste test? So what exactly is Green Market? Green Market is an organic grocery store located on 23rd Street and Hennepin Avenue in Uptown Minneapolis. Green Market is a storefront business with the primary goal of earning a profit. Our mission statement is to provide the community we operate in with a friendly, healthy, an environmentally sustainable organic store. Our vision statement is, in the future, Green Market hopes to become one of the leading organic grocers in Minnesota, growing in not only our product range, but also the size of our Green Market community. Green Market also is going to offer our target market a convenient location because of the fact that our location is highly populated with our target market. We will also offer as much USDA organic produce as possible. Our target market and primary people we will be advertising to are well-educated females between the age of 30 and 40 who spend the majority of their time with their families. Uh, to get a better picture of who our target market is, uh, here's an example of who they are and what they're looking for. Um, that are not organic, there's a lot of depleted mineral 
levels of vitamins in the food. For example, there's not hardly any zinc left in vegetables and fruits that are not organic anymore. And so the food is a lot healthier when you buy organic. Plus, there's such a rise of cancer that that is, um, there's a lot of evidence leading to the fact of eating non-organic foods that have a lot of chemicals, a lot of additives, preservatives, um, and again, the, the chemicals that they put on the seed before it grows. Where do you shop? I shop at Lakewinds and Valley Natural Foods, but I also shop at Target, Cub, and Rainbow. Um, I buy... Mostly organic, but I would say I probably buy 20% not organic. Do those stores? That they were organic. I look for a health food store that is large. So, for example, Lakewinds is further away, but it's on the way to where I go for appointments. So I will stop there before I will go to Valley Natural Foods just because it's larger. And when a store is larger with organic, usually the is a lot cheaper at Lakewood Swiss cheese. So I will try to get there for some of the bigger I look for that the food is not GMO, genetically modified, um, that it was grown in a way that God intended when we created food, that it wasn't changed um, and modified through science, changed in a way that God did not intend. look for, um, sometimes at a health food store they will sell things that are not true organic only because they're not licensed to be organic yet, but they're still grown without the chemicals, but the soil isn't quite clean enough that it can be certified organic, which is fine with me as long as, you know, it's better than the food that is completely non-organic. So I just look that it's, that it's just a better quality and, and more towards organic than the other foods. I know that at the health food stores, a lot of times when you look around, they will have foods there that will be non-organic just because it's a season or it's a time of year that it's hard to get certain fruits, things like that, and I will even say non-organic at those stores. And I will purchase those items once in a while because my kids want oranges or they want grapes and sometimes it's hard to get organic. Yeah. What's more important when you do shop again? The quality of the food or the price? The quality of the food. I definitely pay a lot more money to buy organic food. We try to do less snacks, processed snacks, so we can afford more organic food, which means making more homemade snacks, more, but they tend to be healthier snacks, which is good in the